Okay, I figured it's time for a progress report, even though there hasn't been a whole lot of progress. Two out of three stands are built. The third stand goes in the back of the room. It will be a smaller one. That will be put in last after I have everything else up and running. As you can see, the, the 12 foot on the left and the 12 foot on the right are up. The stands are built like I did my last ones. I know people say you have to have wood on wood, but it lasted 23 years last time before I started having any rotting issues and settling. So this year, or this time, everything is covered in polyurethane, including the feet. So that should make it a little longer, plus yeah, it lasts another 23 years. I'll be lucky if I'm still in fish in my mid 80s. So, anyway, they're all sanded, polyurethane. It's not the best wood in the world, but I think it came out cool. Um, as we've seen before, it's hard to see on here because it's dark up in there. There is air running all the way around the room. And I think I'm getting blurry here. But air runs all the way around the room and then you know, top, middle rows of air. I only put the, the two rows of air in. Like I said, everything's looped. I also put in drains, which are three high. So you got one up there. There's the air, the next row of drains, and the bottom row of drains. And all the drains run and meet up one spot and go out across the basement into the sump pump with about a six inch drop over there. The fun part was hooking all the drains up and coming down around other pipes that I've already put up. So I had to heat things up, bend them, and spray paint them. They're not the prettiest, but the idea is these will blend into the wall behind all the stands and tanks so that you really won't see it. I'm in the process of building the incoming water uh, which you can see running across at the top, comes down, runs across the next row, and of course the bottom row. Now, so far I have not run it out of the room, I have not gotten everything done. Um, trying. This part seems like it's taken me a while, but between family, work, all that stuff, it's just uh, not moving too well. I did buy my valves. Um, got one of them stuck in here. It doesn't look like it goes in all the way. It's pretty darn tight. I don't want to break something. Have to start over again, but as tight as it is, it should seal up. Um, like I said before, the back wall will be left vacant until I get the rest of the room started running and then I will add the stand and the tanks to the back wall. I got to get these things running and get out of the temporary housing. Don't have time to run clean the temporary housing and do this. Um, middle of putting electric on the back of this tent of the stands, things like that. As you can see yeah, I've got some there. There's going to be a separate one for the lighting. But anyway, everything is dark in here. But when you get the tanks in, lights on the tanks, they should stand out. And then I can turn the lights off in the ceiling because they do get a bit bright. Anyway, thank you for watching.